Right, match day 10 of 46. Extra home. I've took a massive risk here because behind me, as you can see, tunnels. And obviously, as we all know by now, Charlton fans and players love tunnel jumps. I'd stop myself jumping down there. Looked at the lineup, so I'm not too sure about it. What, what, Blackett, Taylor, Aniki, Tedic, and Maystein. So I don't know what formation she's going with, so we'll see when we get in there. Same old as usual. Try and talk to some people on the way in. If we don't get it, we don't get it. Under the lights, let's see how we get on. Come on, Charlton, enjoy the vlog. Cheers. Self Name's James, ex James. City fan. Lovely, Looking forward to the game today. Yeah, don't worry about them, they'll be alright. That's alright. Uh, first of all, I want to say, one of making a trip, mate, it's a long old trip, innit? Thank so, you very much. Yeah, yeah, not for me, I'm, I'm just in London. Oh, I've come with it okay, as an ex right. City supporters group in London. So, yeah, we've oh, all come We've all right. come locally today. Congratulations, then. Good record today, then. What are you expecting? I'm expecting it to be a tight one, to be honest. Both teams, you know, we've struggled our last few games. I know Charlton have had a great start to the season. But uh, it's going to be, yeah, I think it's going to be a tight one, a draw, a draw, one-all, one-all. And uh, who's, who's the main man at Exeter? Who do you want to watch out for, Charlton? Dimitri Mitchell, um, he's had a great start to the season for Exeter, so hoping it's going to be a positive one again, but obviously I know you guys have got Alfie May and, and he's yeah, going to be a, t a threat all the time. He's so. been scoring too much this season, but he's been alright and he, he works hard, so hopefully he'll get a couple today. To, yeah, uh, it'll be interesting, it'll be a tight one. And uh, just score prediction. One-all. One all. One all. Jen, thank you very Superb. much. No worries. Right, got true of Exeter fans. Guys, introduce yourselves. All right, I'm Henry. I'm Aiden. I'm Aiden. Ruben. Ruben? Yeah. Guys, what about the journey today? How was it? Great, we live in London now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're we're, we're originally so from Devon, but we moved here, so. Oh, all right, so no Perfect for us. <laughs> yeah, so you get home early tonight. Exactly. Yeah. Guys, what do you reckon today? What are you fancying? 2 1. Uh, 2 0, Exeter. 3-1. 3-1. So all things you've got to win? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. You've got to be optimistic. Who's the danger man for you? Like, who have we got to watch out for? Mitchell. Mitchell for, for yeah, yeah. Like last I said Mitchell as well. Yeah. yeah. And uh, how, do you, how do you guys line up? Like, what's your formation typically? How do you... Three back. Three back. Wing backs. Or is it quite attacking, counter-attacking or...? More attacking than you think for the, for the five at the back, but... Yeah. Yeah, I, I think Kyle will be wing backs today, even though I prefer him midfield. But so yeah. far, good starts this season, really, you would say. Yeah, yeah. God, very good. Yeah, yeah. Overperforming. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> doing well. Beat doing well. The Happy with it, yeah. 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 Well, I won't give too long, so we'll get some drink stuff as you get in there. So, just a quick one score predictions again 2 0, 2 1, 3 1, was it? Yeah, 2 0. 3 1. And who are the goal scorers? Sorry. I'm going to go Mitchell yeah. and Partridge. I'm going to corner. Oh. Mitchell Partridge. Yeah. And I'll go Scott and Mitchell. Mitchell 2, Sonny Cox off the bench gets one. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay. Okay. Yes. Exeter fans, what are we saying? Score tonight? I think Exeter are going to win. I think it's going to be a classic 2 1. I know yeah. that sounds like I'm pretty much on the fence, but you know, with the power that we've been displaying <laughs> over the last few months, I think it's going, be, uh, it's going to be a pretty easy victory tonight. Bloody hell, that's not what I want to hear. <laughs> Safe travel sheds, right yeah. yourself? Uh, yeah, I agree with him. I agree. <laughs> God, blind. We're going to lose tonight. Everyone said you're going to win so far. <laughs> Cheers. Is do self chat. Hi, good morning. The, the my name is Alex. Yeah, and we're being told to move apparently, but yeah, no, it's all right. good. Yeah, hi. Yeah. Hi. hi. So my name is Alex, and and I do follow Exeter City home and away. Yeah. Every what, season. What do you reckon tonight? What's the predictions? I'm going to go for City win. Yeah. I know the the chips are down. I'm a little bit, but so I'm back and going, and the boys. I think they're going to turn it around. Yeah. Uh, I don't reckon um, a 2 0 win. Prediction, yep. See, yep, yep, see. And um, what do you, you reckon is the score tonight for you guys? Who do you reckon is going to get the goals? I reckon yeah, Mitchell's going to come back in with one. Yep. And. It'll be, I'm a little bit against the run of form, but. I'll let you go straight in. Okay, uh, you can go right through. Okay, we can go right through. I'm here to score for a while, a while but Ryan Trevor is going to bang one in from 30 yards. Right? <laughs> Alex, leave it to it, right? Enjoy yeah, the night. Right.
bit of a delayed reaction here. Well, I it's extra 1 0. Um, Charlton went through on goal. Niki just about offside. Good finish under the keeper's legs, but sure by left of the 10 inch. Maybe got a chance. Muddle up at the back. Beats the offside trap 1 on 1. Good finish, but to be fair, they've been close game. Not much in it. I will say that Exeter fans are noisy, mate. Making a good racket. Not bought too many, obviously, because it's a Tuesday night. You know, Devon based team, but makes the right racket. And uh, that's it, really. Unlucky, miss that. And we're unlucky just to be offside. So we'll see. Uh, yeah, pretty close game so far. Oh, 
Obviously 4-1, I'm fuming, I'm fuming, I didn't record the tunnel jump, so I might actually cry, yeah? So yeah, but 10 men definitely helped, obviously, you know, 60th minute red cards, but to be fair, I still think second half, we look like a better team anyway, so I, don't, I still think the result would have stayed the same, maybe not 4-1, but you know, yeah. but, um, but yeah, no, 4-1, deserved, happy for Appleton, because, um, just looks more promising. And, uh, that's that. Um, I'll probably close it there. Fair play, fair play, Texas. Tuesday night as well. Our Londoners have seen. Great um, fan by them. They're very vocal. Uh, battle season, for the bunch, for the, for the bunch they bought as well. So, yeah, fair. Trial four one. On to the next one, Black Row. Guys, see you on the floor.